Hello you beautiful people, welcome to another video here at Topic X. Today we are talking about why can't I get over my ex? Why can't I move on? It's really pissing me off. And I'm speaking from personal, um, what I'm personally thinking. And so I believe there's other people out there, well I know, in the same boat as me. We're all on a journey together, guys. And uh, that's what I love about you guys. We're all on it together. And so I thought to myself yesterday, it's, it's been nearly six months or six months. Why am I still thinking about her all the time? Why am I missing her? Why, why do I still go out to work and, and, and think I see her in the car when she's nowhere around this area? What is going on? What are all these fucking tricks in my head, you know, am I losing the plot? Why am I seeing her everywhere? I mean, it's crazy. I was like driving um, yesterday, driving along, and I thought I saw her in in the village I, I live in, just walking up up the road, the back of her. And I almost near enough turned the car around just to double check. It's fucking crazy. So when when am I going to stop this? I mean, when is it going to be? I'm never going to think about her again. And that is why I'm making this video. Because we think about them because we love them. They broke our heart and we still love them. We didn't want this. We want them to come back. And so sometimes I think, how nice would that be if she reached out and and said, I want you back. And then we met up and it was absolutely wonderful. And the anxiety just stopped straight away because I got my girl back, <clears throat> you know, and we, and we go back to normal and it's, oh, uh, it would be amazing. But unfortunately life isn't a film and, uh, we've just got to fucking suck it up. Simple as that. But the reason why I want to make this video is because I know a lot of you guys are in the same situation where you're thinking about them all the time. You think you see them all the time. Everything reminds you on telly reminds you of them, you know, and it's crazy. But we ask ourselves, when will it bloody stop? Yeah, it gets easier. It definitely gets easier. I'm not in the bad state like I was. Oh, my God, I was in a, the worst state ever. <clears throat> and hence why I started this channel. Um, for therapy, really, because I knew other people were going through it. So I believe that the more weeks, uh, months go by, it would just fade off. But I also believe this, and I know this, I'm never going to forget her. And part of me doesn't want to ever forget her. She broke my heart, yeah, but she's not a nasty person. She didn't do it on purpose. It just wasn't for her. I wasn't for her. She wanted more. And why wouldn't she? This is what you ask, ask yourself, guys. Your ex. It's a good way to sort of let them go. We loved each other at one point. But at another point, I wasn't enough. And she needed to go and spread her wings. And why shouldn't she? We only live once. And so you start to think clearly after the pain and the hurt and the anger. And you can rationalise it a bit more. And so, yeah, I'm never going to forget her and I don't want to forget her because she was a very important part of my life at that stage. And it would be lovely if she just come swanning back in and it would be magical, but I don't think that would happen. And so I want to make this video, as I said, to say we're all going through the same thing. And it will get easier. But people in the roar of it, because I've had a few emails, and they're, they're right at the point, like the, the two-week mark, you know, and Christmas is coming up and it's just getting too much for them. And I think to myself, I was there. I know what it feels like so bad. And I can tap into myself again and bring up that raw emotions and almost just feel for them because I know how bad it is. It's like you, you just want to die. You want to die because you, you can't, the pain's so bad. Like if I had a headache, I'd take a paracetamol 
half an hour later the pain would go. But this, you can't find anything to get rid of the pain. And so we just have to fight through it. And that's the worst thing, isn't it, is fighting through it. And when someone says time is a great healer, heal, you know, heals you, we ain't got no fucking time for that. We want the pain gone now. This hurts too much. Go. But in time, it does get a lot easier. And I'm glad I'm out of that, uh, the, the manic stage of splitting up with someone. So really, this video is just, I just want to give you an update of how I'm feeling, basically, guys. You know, there isn't a strict topic on this. I will say, you know, in time you will get over your ex. But hey, you know what? Maybe I don't want to get over my ex. She was a lovely girl. I mean, in the future, I'm going to meet someone and, and fall in love again. That's a definite. I know that. But anyway, that's about it. Bit of a rambling, pointless video. But I love you all. See you later.